Okay, on this video what we're going to do is going to replace the inlet clamp in a Myra Sport. This clamp actually is used in over 20 of Myra showers and so whichever one it is the rules are exactly the same and the way of fitting it is exactly the same. On, um, on some of the early sports it's got a, a, a clamp similar to this although it's slightly different in shape but once again the same rules apply. And so before you start any work in the shower as usual make sure you turn the power off and switch the water off. Okay, here we go. Now, to remove the cover of the sport, it's got two screws at the top and one at the bottom, but uh, I removed these earlier. And this is the pipe cover here. And this is the clamp here, this white clamp here. This clamp comes in white, black and grey, but it's all actually the same thing, so don't worry about the colour if it's different to the one you've got. And usually it's a hairline crack that comes in this and it weeps water from the bottom. And the, crack, the clamp itself is very easy to replace, but there's a reason, usually, for the clamp having split. And it's just over the years the plastic has hardened, and it's because, mostly, the pipe has been put in at a slightly off square angle, and it's put pressure on the clamp. And so just check that, your clamp, that the inlet connector is going in absolutely straight. The other reason that these, um, that these split is when the plumber's come and tightened up, he's just tightened up and of course what he's done is he's put a lot of pressure on the clamp and this is, may have had a hairline crack in it where he should have been holding against himself and using two pairs of pliers when he tightened this up. However, just check when you're, doing your, when you're replacing the clamp that you make sure the pipe's square and there's no strain on the new clamp. And as I said, it's fairly simple to fit. You'll need a torque screw, a screwdriver with a Torx T10 bit and once the water's off, it's just a case of unscrewing this. Oops. Like so. The clamp just pulls forward and then the pipe should come off you like this. And if it's, if it's at all not straight, this is the time where you've got to actually make sure you get the, the, uh, this pipe entering absolutely square. And then it's just a case of refitting the clamp. Now the only problem you can have here is to check that, there's not, that the screw holes haven't cracked. Because if they've cracked, Myra don't sell back plates. <clears throat> so whichever shower you've got, if in fact any of the bits at the back are cracked, you're going to need a new shower. Um, and so this just basically pops back on like that and the two screws go back in um, and then basically that's once you basically that's you got it fixed. Put one on in there. And that's you fixed. It's that simple. And as I say, the only thing to watch is to make sure that this, is, this uh, inlet connector is in straight. 